All right, guys, so in this one, I wanna talk to you about what is that one thing that you should be doing at the end of every single appointment so that way the patient feels like they see more value in what you just did, two, they feel more confident in what you did, and they also feel ready to come back for that second visit. So here's the one thing that you should be doing at the end of every single appointment. You, you may be doing this already, but essentially it comes down to when you finish up your treatment, when you finish, when you raise the patient chair up, they, they're, in this, they're still in the chair, you're done with the treatment, take your mask off, take your glasses off, look them in the eye and summarize what you just did. Summarize what you did and then also, here's the key, while you're summarizing what you did, Point out one or two of the things that worked out really well that you're happy about. And then also point out some areas that you're like, okay, this is an area of concern, but we have X, Y, and Z that we're really happy about. So I'm really happy with the way things came out and I'm looking forward to seeing this area heal up good and this tooth doing well and all those other good things about what you just did. When you start layering the summary after the procedure and then talking about the things that you're happy about and maybe some areas that were, you know, co as concerns for you, you not only come across more open and transparent, but you come across more confident in the procedure that you actually did and that brings more value to what you did. So a lot of times we just raise that patient chair up and we just say, okay, let's get your schedule, let's get you scheduled in for that next appointment. We'll get you in for the next appointment, but we forget to talk about what you did today. Now you may even think the patient knows what I did because they just got it done, but they always like to hear and they always like to get it reinforced and they like to get it endorsed and they want that affirmation of, hey, this is what was done. You're endorsing your work. You always have to endorse your work. And the best way to do it is to summarize, point out a couple things that you're happy with, and then also talk about maybe a concern or two to keep it, keep it transparent, keep it real if you have one, and then also endorse the way you feel about what you just did. So try that the next time you're done with one of your appointments and you'll see patients will feel a lot more comfortable with what you did. They're gonna feel more confident with it. They're gonna see more value in what you did, which is always good when you're raising the value perception of your treatment. And they're also gonna feel more confident and ready to come back for that next appointment with your office. So hope that helps. I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching these. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought. And as always, live inspired.